What happens in your body when you stretch? Stretching is increasing the range of motion of one or more of your joints, the places in your body where bones meet. If you were just a skeleton, you would be very flexible because there would be nothing keeping your bones from moving at the full range allowed by your joint. But if you were just a skeleton, you would not be able to move at all. Movement is possible because of your muscles. Muscles attached to the bone on either side of a joint allow you to move those bones. The length and condition of those muscles determine how far the bones can move within the joint. Some people can pick up a dropped pen without bending their knees, while some have to crouch down to pick up the pen because their hamstring muscles don't stretch far enough. These people have the same muscles and joints, but they're in different conditions. When you bend down to touch your toes, the muscles elongate, giving you leeway to bend further. Those muscles are made up of thousands of small fibers called myofibrils. These muscle fibers are made up of smaller sections, much like the partitions in a stalk of bamboo. Each of these compartments are called sarcomere. Each sarcomere has several layers called myofilaments stacked on top of each other. There are two types of layers, thick, myosin, and thin, actin. When we stretch, the alternating layers are pulled apart so that only the tips of each layer overlap. When we contract our muscles, the layers are pulled almost directly on top of each other. When we stretch, not all of the sarcomere compartments react. Some remain contracted and are merely displaced by the sarcomere around them. The more sarcomere that we can coax into elongating, the further our muscles will extend and the further our stretch will reach. The longer we hold a relaxed stretch position, the more sarcomere will elongate. It is important to warm up our muscles through light cardio and strength movements before we stretch. This is because a cold muscle is composed of tight overlapping sarcomere layers. As we utilize our muscles, the layers in the sarcomere begin to unclench. This provides greater range of motion from which we can begin stretching more effectively. Warming up is like kneading pizza dough before you roll it out. If you don't knead the dough, it will rip. If you don't warm up the muscles, they too will rip instead of stretch. There are two ways our muscles protect themselves from injury. One is called the muscle spindle, and its job is to prevent a muscle from lengthening so much that the muscle tears. It is like a policeman stopping a car from going too fast by pulling it over. The muscle spindle has a length to which it knows the muscle can safely stretch. If a muscle is stretched past that point, the muscle spindle can force the muscle to stop stretching to prevent tearing, the same way a traffic cop stops a speeding car to prevent a collision. The other is the Golgi tendon organ, or GO organ, which encourages the muscles to lengthen. The GO organ monitors the tension of the muscles and will send a message to the muscle to lengthen in response to long bouts of slowly increasing tension. When you go into a stretch quickly, the spindle responds by contracting the muscle quickly to prevent injury. But when you go into a stretch in a slow, controlled manner and stay there over a long period of time, the muscle spindle sets a new safe length for the muscle. It effectively raises the speed limit. The GO organ senses the slowly increasing tension and sends the signal for your muscle's sarcomere sections to release and lengthen further. Martial artists, dancers, gymnasts, and athletes perform extensive stretching and strength training on a daily basis to teach their muscles to perform the feats they are well known for. But every person has the potential to be flexible. It just takes time, patience, and an understanding of how your muscles work. This video is brought to you by the Size Stretcher, the ultimate stretching partner. It holds you in many stretch positions so that you can focus on relaxing your muscles and training your spindle to recognize new lengths. Available on Amazon. Please don't forget to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And please check out the other videos on my YouTube channel.